Say hi, Zay. Hi, YouTube. It's me and Xavier's 12 week update. He's technically 12 weeks on Friday, but he's in his 12 week, 12 week of life today or this week anyway. So we're going to do his update. My baby boy is a happy, bouncing baby boy, and well, he's very active and very alert and keeps mommy very busy. Um, let's see. Xavier had a checkup. He went to get his second hepatitis B shot. And at his checkup, they said that he is only 21 inches long, so he's still short. And he's only grown like an inch and three quarters total since birth because he was 19 and three quarter inches when he was born. So he's only grown one and one quarter. <laughs> Anyway, as you see, he's amazed with his image. He um, likes to look at himself. He gets that from his dad. But, so other than his length, he is 11 and a half, 12 pounds. He was 11 and a half pounds, paying eight or 12, so. I don't know. He doesn't feel like 12 pounds to me, but the weight that the scale doesn't lie, unless it's wrong, but that's what they said. So he's a big. 11 and a half pounder, look at her. You see yourself, Luffy? Huh? Do you see yourself? Who's that baby? Zay! Zay! You see yourself? Hi, handsome. Show that good smile. Mm. Big boy. Okay, um. They did his physical, and basically he's right on target, or I could see some of the stuff that he's supposed to be. He's doing more than what he's supposed to be doing right now based off his, um, his two-month checkup and his physical that they do. Um, like I said, he's already, you know, he can go from, from a sitting position. If you hold him, he'll pull himself up to a standing position like this without me pulling him. Um, ugh. Well, cricket. He will um, at turn during tummy time. He tries to crawl still, and he's making progress with that. He recognizes everyone now, from my sister to of course his grandmother's, who he's looking at right now. You see, grandma? Yeah. You see yourself is what it is. Okay. Um, what else? He's sleeping during the night more. He sleeps about six, sometimes five, sometimes six hours a night. Usually he'll go to sleep around 12 and wake up around 7. Um, well, close to around 12, wake up around 2 for a feeding. He goes right back to sleep after his feeding. And he's up at 7. And he goes back to bed around 10. So he is up, he plays more, like typically right now he would have been, he ate at 2.30, it's 4.45, he typically would be getting ready to go to sleep to take another nap, but he's up, he's alert, he's playful, he, um, his little car seat thing that we got to go on his car seat, or on the bar of his car seat so he's going to play with, he actually plays with it now, he's spinning around, he knows how to press the button for the doggy to bark or activate, Ugh. he drools a lot. Um, let's see, he, oh. he's officially no longer getting any breast milk, he's a soy baby, he takes soy milk, because he has a slight lactose intolerance to milk, so he's on soy right now, here, 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 look. There you go. He's a big boy. Is it Zay? Yay, Zay. He's um, right now in size one diapers. He started to get into size one diapers um, at 10 weeks. And I think he's. Are you pooping? He might be pooping right now. <laughs> but um, so now he's officially in size one diapers, but there's still a little. 
probably still a little big on him. Um, probably because he's short still, but for his weight, he's in a size one now. And well, I think that's it. He's doing good. He's healthy and happy, and he has his eye appointment on the 15th. He drools a lot, like I said. Um, but he still hasn't um, gotten any very much darker. He's still kind of uh, <laughs> still kind of bright. Please have a seat, sir. Have a seat. But I really don't think at this point, I really don't think it's going to get very much darker right now until probably summertime. So, who said no? Yeah. Alright. So he's starting to get a little fussy. So I think maybe he does need to go down for a nap or he's trying to poop. But to me, it seems like he's trying to poop. Are you pooping? Yeah. He's pooping. Okay. Mommy and Hopi poop. Come on. Oh yeah, so he's been a little he's been having a hard time pooping lately when we switched him over from um, the newborn formula to the soy formula because he kind of had a couple of hard bowel movements and it was rough on him so he would cry and he has to help you know kind of made him constipated for a little bit but now he's doing better it's like a dark green color now I don't okay okay come on you can do it come on it's okay no is it hard is it hard but I will say he took me, oh god, he talks a lot. Like he'll sit there and wake up in the morning instead of crying, he'll just sit there and talk. And all you hear is, ow, 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 That's what he could be talking, that's what he does in the morning. He doesn't fuss that much. Come on, baby. Come on, baby. Come on. He giggles, and it's the funniest thing. Like, if I took a little kid to kiss his neck and giggle, he'd go, <laughs> like, it's so cute. But, yeah, that's his favorite 12 weeks. Um, last time I had an update, he threw up in it, and now he's pooping in this one. So, excuse his uh, camera etiquette. He's learning still. Better out than in. Come on. Come on. Remember what you're telling me about you? Oh, yeah, it's a hard one. So, I'm going to help him make, have his bowel movement. Okay, okay. Yeah, I'm going to help him have his bowel movement, and we'll see you guys later. Bye.